Hey there pirates, welcome aboard the Anime Nomi channel. Although the reasons for Dragon abandoning his son with his father Garp are still hidden, there are several indications of the motives that the leader of the Revolutionary Army may have taken this difficult decision. In today's video, we will talk about these possible reasons, demonstrating that even though Dragon is not a present father, he does indeed care a lot about Luffy and his future in an indirect way. Before we dive into the video, don't forget to smash that like button, give us a thumbs up to unlock your devil fruit powers and hit that subscribe button to awaken. Now, let's jump into the video. Guys, the One Piece universe is full of unexpected twists. One of these twists occurred with the foundation of the Revolutionary Army, a formidable organization that challenges the world government. This revolution was led by none other than Monkey D. Dragon, an enigmatic character who, by incredible coincidence, is the father of Monkey D. Luffy, the fearless protagonist of the series. The creation of the Revolutionary Army was a crucial event, occurring a few years after Luffy's birth. Dragon, known as the worst criminal in the world, world is the son of Monkey D. Garp, a vice admiral in the Navy. However, Dragon chose a radically different path from the one his father took in the Navy. By deciding to establish the Revolutionary Army, Dragon took a bold stance against the world government and its oppressive policies. His goal was to fight for freedom and justice, challenging the power structures that kept the world in a state of inequality. This decision, however, had profound consequences in his personal life, especially for his newborn son, Luffy. With an unwavering sense of purpose, Dragon left Luffy in the care of his own father, Monkey D. Garp. Garp, despite his loyalty to the Navy, was a man of principles and love for his family. Taking on the responsibility of raising his grandson was a burden he accepted with determination. While Dragon led the revolution against the world government, Luffy grew unaware of the destiny that awaited him and the legacy he carried in his blood, something that could make him a target worldwide from childhood. Dragon's decision to rebel against the world government was not just an act of defiance, but also an extreme measure to protect the entire world from the corruption he saw within the Navy and, strongly, within the world government. Dragon's trajectory became even more complex when, after leaving the Navy, he chose to distance himself from his family. By abandoning his family life, Dragon made a painful sacrifice for the safety of his loved ones. He realized that his fight against injustice and oppression put his family at imminent risk. Dragon's presence alongside the Revolutionary Army was a direct threat to the world government, and sacrificing his family ties became a necessity to protect those he loved. Dragon's choice reflects a deep understanding of the consequences of his actions. By rebelling against a corrupt global system, he knew he was putting a target on his back, but he also understood that his loved ones would be equally targeted. Thus, Dragon made the difficult decision to distance himself from his family to ensure they did not become victims of the battle he chose to fight. This separation from Dragon had a lasting impact on the lives of those he left behind. Luffy, growing up without the presence of his father, embarked on a tumultuous and challenging journey. While Garp continued to be an essential father figure in Luffy's life, Dragon's absence weighed on the young pirate's heart. Although Garp was known for his loyalty to the Navy and strict principles, Dragon's decision to rebel against the world government was not easily understood by the Vice Admiral. The division between father and son, resulting from Dragon's distancing, stirred complex feelings feelings in Garp. He, who always valued service to the Navy and upholding justice, found himself in a situation where his own son chose a path that defied everything he stood for. Despite his reservations and a lack of complete understanding of Dragon's motivations, Garp understood the urgency of protecting Luffy. Garp, who had already experienced the responsibilities of raising a grandchild after Roger's decision to abandon Ace, was familiar with the emotional and practical challenges of being the guardian of a child. Garp accepted the task of caring for Luffy, not only as a family obligation, but also as an act of love and protection. He saw in Luffy the burning flame of determination and the indomitable spirit inherited from his father and decided to take on the responsibility of guiding him in Dragon's absence. The relationship between Garp and Luffy has become a vital part of the One Piece narrative. While Garp maintained his duty to the Marines, he also recognized the importance of preserving the legacy and safety of the family. Garp, the hero of the Marines, became not only a symbol of impersonal justice, but also an affectionate grandfather who wished to protect his grandson from the turmoil caused by the revolution led by his own father. 
Garp's acceptance as Luffy's guardian was not just an act of compassion, but also a way to guide Luffy to follow in his footsteps, becoming a Marine so that Dragon's sins would not fall upon him in the future. The distance between Dragon and Luffy did not signify a complete emotional disconnection on the part of the revolutionary. As time passed and Luffy grew, Dragon, while maintaining his revolutionary mission, continued to secretly follow his son's achievements through news and reports reaching the revolutionary army. The grandeur of Luffy's adventurous spirit and his determination to follow the path of pirates did not go unnoticed by Dragon. Although the choice to become a pirate seemed, at first glance, a trajectory distant from the revolution Dragon led, the revolutionary realized that his son was destined for remarkable feats. Luffy's future became unpredictable, a journey filled with challenges, unexpected allies, and epic confrontations. However, Dragon trusted in Luffy's inner strength and the impact he could have on the world. Even though the paths of father and son were separated, Dragon's pride grew with each news confirming Luffy's bold accomplishments. Dragon's decision to silently observe Luffy's progress reveals a unique blend of paternal duty and revolutionary commitment. It demonstrates that he truly cares for Luffy even from a distance. While leading a revolt against a corrupt system, Dragon recognized that his family's legacy was also being forged in another battlefield. The tumultuous seas where Luffy challenged powerful figures, faced adversities, and formed unbreakable bonds with his crewmates. News from the New World full of extraordinary events featuring Monkey D. Luffy reached Dragon, who, despite maintaining a considerable distance, continued to feel great pride for his son. The revelation of the connection between Monkey D. Luffy and Monkey D. Dragon brought a series of implications and conflicts in the world of One Piece, especially in the relationship between Luffy and Sakazuki, better known as Akainu, the Marine Admiral. Akainu's fervent hatred towards Luffy was not just a reflection of their ideological differences, but also also stemmed from Luffy being the son of the revolutionary leader, a secret that Dragon initially sought to keep to protect his son. The revelation of this secret, hidden in the shadows, further heightened tensions between Luffy and Akainu. Akainu, with his incandescent fury and unwavering loyalty to absolute justice, saw in Luffy not only a challenging pirate, but also an embodiment of the revolutionary ideals he detested. For Dragon, discovering that the secret of his paternity toward Luffy had been exposed was a delicate moment. He always knew that the truth would eventually come to light, but the urgency to protect his son was always his top priority. However, over time, and witnessing Luffy's feats throughout his journey, Dragon began to realize that his son was capable of facing the challenges that awaited him. Luffy's strength, determination, and ability to gather loyal and powerful allies reassured Dragon that, even with his identity revealed, Luffy was far from unprotected. The Straw Hat crew was not just a group of adventure companions. They were a formidable family, willing to face any adversity to protect their captain. The shift in Dragon's perspective regarding Luffy's safety demonstrates the trust he places in his son's growth and resilience. As the battle between the Marines and pirates intensifies, Dragon can watch from afar, knowing that Luffy is not alone. The Straw Hat has become a force to be reckoned with, and Dragon, while still committed to his revolutionary mission, finds comfort in the fact that his son is in good hands. Thus, the narrative between Dragon, Luffy, and Akainu continues to unfold as a strong and important family relationship. Loyalty, revealed secrets, and the eternal conflict between justice and freedom in one piece. That's a wrap for today's content. We hope you enjoyed it and want to share your thoughts on the subject. Don't forget to share the video, give it a thumbs up, and catch you in the next video. Take care and stay awesome.